distinguishing knowledge graphs from uh, property graphs, and property graphs I uh, would just call data graphs, in other words, property graphs have just the facts. We see them in the bottom layer here, uh, but we add to, the, to these facts uh, models in the form of ontologies and then rules. And to illustrate what this is about, I will use a very, very simple uh, fact graph um, with three triples, uh, three, pieces, three pieces of knowledge here that James, this could be James Bond, has blue eyes. James' father is, is Andrew, and James is a person. This is all we know about James. At the model layer, and the model is still a graph, we define what a person is or what would be true about a person. So a person has eyes, uh, eyes have eye color, a person has two parents, and a person's father is also a person with, with gender male. Uh, rules would be, uh, we have heredity rules, a very simple one, that if you, uh, a person with blue eyes must have had parents with blue eyes. That's how heredity works. So given this information we, we have, these three bits of information, we can conclude that Andrew also has blue eyes. That's not stored in our knowledge graph, but we can conclude it based on the model and based on these rules we have in place. So then a, a search uh, for all people with blue eyes would get back uh, Andrew as well as James. And again, this isn't stored information, this is uh, information we've deduced or knowledge we've deduced based on what we know. And we're able to do that because we have the model and rules in place. Now with a regular graph, um, uh, just a property graph that you get from a graph store vendor, uh, you, you would get back in that search just the fact that uh, James, has, James has blue eyes. You want to get back that Andrew has blue eyes because we don't have the, the smarts for how to work with that data. Uh, that, so that's smart, that bit of logic and model information, um, if any, may be put into application code. That's the most common approach. Uh, to, to handling that with, with regular property graphs. So we find having the models and the rules also as graphs is, is easier to work with, to maintain, to um, you know, add to and manage later, and, and to reuse, importantly. We can reuse these models and rules with other, other graphs.